Hi, this is Crime and Partner. Welcome back to Let's Play Valkyrie Profile. In this video, we're actually going to be facing off against Gabriel Celeste, and with him out of the way, it'll open up the final stretch of the Seraphic Gate. Now, I'm not really going to worry about preparation for this fight because, honestly, I don't need to that much. Yes, Gabriel Celeste is a guy. No, he doesn't look like a guy. I don't know what to tell you. Anyway, it seems like he wants to challenge me. And he's right about one thing. It is going to be a short fight, but not in the way he thinks. Come to me, anyway, he's not too bad. While he can kill one of your team members instantly, he only pretty much uses single target attacks. And that pretty much is his downfall right there. Might reinforce. Valkyrie, grant me power! Finishing strike! Round rip saber! My strike was too weak! Feel the power of darkness! Finishing strike! Oh man, I love Brahms's uh, Purify Weird Soul. It's just so powerful. A real anyway, I'm not gonna worry about doing Lennis uh, Purify Weird Soul right now. Oh. Ooh, that hurts. Wow, talk about overkill much. Jeez. Ow. Aha, dodge. Anyway, we'll go ahead and finish them off next turn. Oh yeah, that's it for him. Grant me power. Finishing strike. Round rip saber. As you can see, I mean, Gabriel Celeste really isn't that difficult. I mean, really, no matter how hard he hits, if he can only kill one person at a time, then he doesn't stand a chance. That's that's just the way it hits. Ye must desire respite from thy empty existence. Thou shalt have it. So yeah, I, I think this will be the coup de gras. Celestial Star! Oh yeah, that's it. My sorcery is invincible. I have been defeated. Well done, heroes. I am sure we will meet again in another time and place. Farewell! Just so you know, he is not lying. Uh, Gabriel Celeste has been in Tri-Ace games since, I don't know, Star Ocean 2? Shoot. Getting the attention of a goddess isn't very I don't know. He, he's been around a lot of Tri-Ace games, though. Aha, look at all that experience. Alright, well, with him out of the way, we can go to the last portion of the Seraphic Gate. But before I do that, I'm going to take a moment to use my capacity points that I earned. So I'll be right back. Okay, with that done, we are ready to go. Now, just to know about this next area, it's pretty much a rehash of bosses I've fought in the past. Pretty much, they do the exact same thing. They just do more damage, and it'll take more damage to kill them. In particular, these two right here are actually um, rehashes of Akhetamen from uh, the Tombs of Amenti. Same thing as before, you know, who used Seraphic Law every four turns or so. He starts off the fight with Reflect Sorcery, 
Yada yada. Honestly, I wouldn't waste my time with this guy. He drops a noble elixir, a noble banish. Yeah, it's better than Lapis Lazuli's like that uh, Dragon Tyrant, but that's still not worth your time. This one right here is another one of those guys, plus it's an eye. You know how I feel about eyes. Uh, that's all I'm going to say on that one. Oh, and the eye drops a Lapis Lazuli. Now that guy there I will be uh, fighting, but not yet. I want to go here first. Reason being, this leads to the final door where I will be using my 8th Flame Jewel. And with that, we've used all 8. And we get the Dane Slip. And... Ether Laser. Great items right here. Uh, with the Dane Slough, we're going to be putting Valkyrie back on swords. Reason being, this thing has 8,000 damage, 3 hits. I mean, it, it's even more than the Glance Reviver. You know, you know, granted, the Glance Reviver had that cool ability, but that whole instant death thing is not going to work in this portion because they're all considered bosses. So there's no point. Anyway, I mean, with, with an attack power boost that big, it'll also really up the damage on her Purified Weird Soul, which... You know, as you've seen, with the amount of health these guys have, most of my damage comes from those attacks. So, you know, as much as I like her using a bow and all the support it gives, this is really the weapon you need to give her. And of course, that will change her skills to melee-based ones, so I'll need to check that before uh, I get into any fights. We also picked up the Ether Laser. This is Freya's weapon. 3 hits, 7800 damage. As you can see, Darkness on Death, that really is me a whole lot here. But just the sheer damage and the fact that we have three hits, it, it means we're going to be using her now. So, I'm sorry, Lucian, but you got to go. Now, I know she has a lot of little toys and everything. Uh, oops. They're not better than the equipment I've been giving to everyone. So, I'll just, you know, replace it. Alright, we'll go ahead and put her in Lucian's spot. Alright, let's see. Okay, yeah, we, we can't have that. And I really don't care about these attacks. I think they're kind of useless, so I'm not going to worry about it. But now we need to look at Freya, who badly needs points. Of course, I mean, it really isn't different. You know, the formula for success as far as skill allocation hasn't changed at this point, so... I'll take care of noise. Alright, we also want to change something here. In particular, her Thunder Sword. This is that one attack where she goes, Can you withstand this? It has a really long wind up and is really better as your first attack. Not just because, you know, again, I have to base all of my attacks around her, but Thunder Sword is unblockable. So if you have Freya lead off your attack with Thunder Sword, you'll always get through. So, we're going to go ahead and change this, make sure Thunder Sword is first. And yeah, that's that'll do it for her. Anyway, with that, we're going to go ahead and backtrack really quick. It's, it's not that far, so I'm not going to worry about editing out anything. Okay, and I'm going to be demonstrating a fight uh, with that little dog wolf thing right there but I don't have time to do it in this episode so in the next video we will be facing off against not one but two carnage beasts ooh scary anyway this is crime and partner thanks for watching see you next crime